Hey guys, Danny Force here, your Dallas Fort Worth Keller Williams Realtor, here to talk to you today about homeowners associations and the extra little bit of paperwork that's involved in buying and selling a home in a mandatory HOA. So if you're using a realtor to sell your home in a mandatory HOA, one of the pieces of paper you should fill out with your listing is this one. It's called the Request for Information from an Owners Association. In that, it lists the property management company and on it, it'll actually notice there's the address as well as what kind of resale information they're going to be requesting. So what this does is it allows the title company to order the resale certificate on your behalf. You will have to pay for it up front as soon as it's ordered. It's usually a few hundred bucks. Each one's different. But in that, it allows the um, HOA to release the CCNRs, which stands for the Creeds, Covenants, and Restrictions, to the buyer for them to review. Now, built into that piece of paper, the buyer has three days from when it's received to review it and back out of the contract with a full refund of their earnest money should they decide they don't like what the HOA bylaws are. But also on the buying side, when you're buying a house in an HOA, part of the paperwork you will submit to the seller is this one. It's called Addendum for a Property and a Mandatory Owners Association. In it, it will have the number of days in which you're requesting for the seller to provide this information to you. And it also will have a box on here, part C, that says if you're going to be reimbursing the sellers for any portion of the money they have already paid for in advance. Sometimes that becomes important in multiple offer situations. So this is one of those bits and pieces you may not be aware of that's required when you're buying and selling a home in a mandatory HOA. If you got a house to sell in Dallas-Fort Worth or you're looking to buy a home, give me a call, 817-903-5442. Find me on the web at www.dannyforce.com. Email me at danny at dannyforce.com. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and my blog and find me on all my other social media.